This is called Imagine This. It's a very easy to do for Ace production. You show a deck of cards in no particular order, and you explain that the cool thing about being a magician is you can control cards. It helps if you're a card player as well. Here, you can actually get a feel for where there might be an ace in the deck just by giving them a cut. You turn it over, and there's ace number one. Now, Sarah's with me. Sarah, did you know I can control your thoughts? No. Seriously, I can. Check this out. As I ripple down like this, I want you somewhere in the center, maybe wherever you like. Just say stop. Stop. Right there. Take a look at the card that you stopped me on. And there you go. That's ace number two. Ace number three. A little bit difficult to do because you um, have to really feel for where you think there's an ace in there. Actually, I feel one 22 from the top, which would be right about there. But if you're good, you can actually control that right up to the top. That's ace number three. Now, Besides controlling the thoughts of people, you can also control their actions. Um, here's what I'm going to show you. Let's give the cards a cut, just like that, one cut. Now I'm going to run through the cards. There's no ace in the beginning. There's no ace in the end. That would lead you, Sarah, to believe there is an ace someplace. In the middle. In the middle, right. And this is what I want you to do. Cut wherever you want, someplace where you think the center is, just like that. Perfect. And look at that. Ace number four. She cut to it, not me. That's called Imagine This, a very easy to do for Ace Production. Imagine This.